What's going on guys this is me Mehdi Shakil and you are watching SS Tech Tutorial. So guys today in this video I'm gonna show you that how you can take a backup of your Mikrotik router and using this backup file you can reconfigure your Mikrotik router. So further ado let's get started. So guys let's assume you accidentally reset your Mikrotik router or you intentionally reset your Mikrotik router and now you don't want to reconfigure it you want to make the router same what it was before the reset in that situation what you will need you need a backup file so in this video I'll show you how to take a backup and after that I will reset my Mikrotik router and also I'll show you how to upload that backup file to restore the configuration on your Mikrotik router so let's start so take a router configuration backup you need to get access to your Mikrotik router then here in the left side you will get an option called files click on it and here you will get an option named backup click on this button backup now name your backup whatever you want let's say I'm gonna type here ok if you want to give a password for your backup file you can set it here let's set a password for our backup file so that no one else can access it and from here you can choose the encryption I'll suggest you go with the default one then click on backup and you will get a backup file with the name whatever you set in my case ok.backup now if you want to download this backup just select it and right click on it and here you will get an option called download so click on download then choose the path where you want to save that downloaded file I'm gonna save it on my desktop then click on OK and you can see here I got the backup file and now if you want to delete the backup file from here just select it and click on this icon and the backup will be removed from your Mikrotik router now let me show you how to restore it but before that I'm gonna reset my Mikrotik router so I'm going to open system and from here go to reset configuration and I'll keep the user configuration then click on reset configuration and yes and you will get disconnect from your Mikrotik router it will take some time to get reset so you have to wait if you want to see your Mikrotik router is reboot or not just click on refresh and you will get your Mikrotik router click on connect to get access now Mikrotik router is reset now let me show you how to use that backup file to reconfigure your Mikrotik router so again go to files then from here click on upload then select the backup file and click on open and you will get your backup file into your Mikrotik router now to restore the configuration select that backup file and click on restore then click on the password and type the password whatever you set during taking this backup then click on restore and after the restore your Mikrotik router will reboot so click on yes you can see I got disconnected from my Mikrotik router and it will take some time to reboot click on refresh and here guys you can see the router is up and also the identity is changed because it restored the configuration from this backup file now just simply log into your Mikrotik router and you will get the previous configuration of your Mikrotik router so guys like this you can easily take backup of your Mikrotik router and restore from the backup if you want so guys that's all for today I hope you like this video if you really like this video and enjoy this video then please give it a big thumbs up and share this video with your friends and guys if you are new to this channel then please do subscribe this youtube channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to get all the latest upcoming video tutorial notification I am Mehdi Shakil you are watching this tech tutorial and I am signing out